I'm a little tempted to doing... Nope, not PvP. Nope. Oh, okay, it's in maintenance, okay. But I am a little tempted to doing this banner. But at the same time, I want to wait until the Super Saiyan Blues come out from the Future Trunks saga. I don't know. I, I have. I don't. I just want to do this for some reason. But to get your hopes up, I'm not gonna do this banner. I'm gonna wait until the Super Saiyan Blues come out. Wait, like, I kind of want to do this, but at the same time, I feel like it's gonna be a waste of crystals. Speaking of crystals, uh, in Dokkan, I've kind of been grinding a little bit. I have like a hundred so stones, but. Yeah, I'm gonna save those stones for for the fifth anniversary and not the Napa banner, cause I was j- that's just a waste. You can either get that Napa or the other Napas, but I'm kind of tempted at doing the summons just because of the fact that that Goku is gonna be pretty strong, but at the same time the Pycon is going to be pretty strong as well. But I've made up my mind. I'm saving for Dragon Ball. Or Dragon Ball. I'm saving for the, uh, the Super, Super Saiyan Blues. Speaking of Dokkan, I've gotten a lot of good stuff. Um, I did, I think I did a couple of summons for the Beers banner. And for the guaranteed featured SSR, I got the Transforming Vegeta, which I love. Even though I, like... Through all like, the events I've done, the, that's far as I can get him a Super Saiyan 2. But I love him so much. He's, I think, a good replacement for the Super Saiyan 2 Khalif I had. But speaking of replacements, uh, well, I'm, let me tell my team in, in Dokkan, even though I'm playing Legends. Um, I have, of course, the LR UI Goku, the best. I have the LR Super Saiyan God Goku. I have the Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. Ooh, I did this. Cool. Oh wait, no, that's a different thing. Okay. Um I have Super Saiyan I have a tech Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta no Super Saiyan Blue Goku. This transforming Vegeta. Um, Goku, Goku, Vegeta, Vegeta. Goku. Who else do I have? I forgot who else I had. Oh, um. Super Saiyan. The Super Saiyan Goku that came out. That, like, he goes Super Saiyan God and then he goes back to Super Saiyan. Uh, I got him rainbowed. My first rainbow. He's pretty cool. I don't know how I forgot about him. Yeah, that's my team in Nocon. And my favorite team in Legends is the Force Fusion. 
And God Key is another one because of the transferring Vegeta. Yeah, I've been using this team for a little bit. I use Fusion. And just so you guys know, I will be doing, of course, summons for Dokkan for the 5th anniversary. And also, some summons for when the Super Saiyan Blues come out. But at the same time, if you guys want to see me grinding on Dokkan, leave a like. It's going to be pretty boring, but I'm just going to be grinding out. As many events as I can. That's kind of one thing that separates Dokkan with Legends. Legends is obviously the better game. Sorry if I offend some of you guys. But Legends just... Not only is it nostalgic for me, but... It's also just better in the amount of crystals that you get. Because in crystals in, in uh, Dokkan... It takes a long, long time. Like, you do, like, five events, so you can do a single summon. You can do a whole event. Well, it takes time, because you have to wait a little bit. Because most likely I'll be able to get, like, to stage 20 in this event. And I'll say I have to wait until, like, the 25th or something to be able to do the rest. But... I think that Legends is still better because of the fact that you get like a thousand in one event and that you can do like one consecutive summon while they like I've completely finished the story event in Dokkan and I, I kind of want to work on getting them all like three stars for every single one well, that's just going to take a long time I'm going to have to waste crystals to get more crystals and I kind of want to don't want to do that, so I'll just wait. And plus, I don't think it's worth all that time in crystals. Dokkan is better in events because the fact that you can have so many event like events to choose from. But if you, it sucks that you have to get medals to awaken some of your characters and those medals can like be involved with an LR that you don't want or if you would like you do want but you don't have and that event is super difficult even though you want to awaken a whole different unit and the fact that you get only one stone for each event Kind of sucks. By the way, I fixed the issues that um, was going on with the recorder app. Apparently, I had so much space on it uh, from previous videos that I had to clear out the the cache, the the cache or whatever it's called, of like all the space I had. And because of all the space, I read somewhere on the recorder app that the some recordings end up stopping because of the fact that I have so much space on it. And I think I figured out, I'm pretty sure I did, fix the problem. I cleared all the empty space, or all the 
the videos that I've already done and are uploaded. And yeah, I won't be like needing to worry about an issue like that until I have to empty it again. And going back to Dokkan, I'm sorry, Legends, I love you, but going back to Dokkan, the anniversary is going to be dope. I can see that already. You can get, like, according to some YouTube channels, I don't know if it's legit, but apparently you'll be able to get 800 stones, and that will be game-changing. You'll have no idea how many videos I will put out of doing the banners for LR Vegito and LR Gogeta and probably get well with the luck that I've had with Dokkan probably get like a rainbow of each one but knowing reality I'll probably get one of them and I'll find with one of them I'm fine but with dealing one of like the one that I want the most I don't see one Vegito the most even though Gogeta is better I need a good green unit for my team cause my my tech Super Saiyan Blue Goku isn't gonna cut it. I mean he's a UR. Uh, he's not that good. Well he's good for now, but I need a better one. I need a better tech God key unit or Realm of the Gods. Gogeta is amazing because of the fact that his his active skill is better. Looking at least I don't know if it's better like attack wise, but. All I know is that Gogeta is my one of my favorites out of all the fusions. But at the same time, Gogeta Blue did come out first instead of Gogeta. Super Saiyan 4 or Super Saiyan Blue. So Gogeta Blue is kind of a little bit like my one of my favorites. Like 1% higher. But all the while, Gogeta, like they're both my favorites. No matter what, they're always going to be my favorites. And if there's a way to fuse both of them. There's no other perfect man you've ever seen out there. No homo. I've seen the videos too of Rhyme Style and Nano doing summons for JP. And it was sick. Like some of the animation. Well, it didn't get crazy, crazy animations, but. It was amazing. Like, the one thing I hate about, um, like, not hate, hate, but, like, have a problem with with Nano or Rhyme Style is that they add, like, intense music before they get an LR. Like, if it's, like, a, like, a dud, like, they get an LR they don't even want, then it's kind of funny. But at the same time, I don't want it, like, being spoiled, you know? I want it to be, like, a surprise. Like, oh, cool, what is he going to get? What is he going to get? And, like, instead of it being a surprise that it's going to be the first unit, the music spoils it. And uh, that kind of sucks. Like, I want it to be a surprise. Like, I'm summoning out on the banner. Knowing Legends is going to stop at this this last one. If not, that's pretty cool. But I think he'll stop at this last one. And honestly, it would be pretty cool if they can have an LR or LF uh, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta that has the times 100 Big Bang Kamehameha. Because that move back in Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3 and 2 was one of my favorite 
like finishers and like Ultimate Gohan and Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta were hands down the most overpowered units in like both those I mean, go like you use Goku a lot. Like I use Goku a lot, cause I mean he's my favorite character. Like besides being a fusion, but my favorite thing to do was I would charge up the spear bomb, and right before I shot the spear bomb, I would uh, use Kao Ken and have a Kao Ken full power spear bomb. And I usually do that in tournaments because as soon as I finish the game, I just do tournaments for fun. Even though I'd always get beaten by my brothers. Ooh, okay, I haven't seen that equipment. And, oh, okay, never mind. I don't know if I'll be able to post the uh, the Dragon Ball Z Kakarot gameplay the, anyway. I've been playing it a lot lately because I've been bored. And I've gotten Goku and Vegeta at least 230 something at like level. And yeah, that's how much I've been grinding. I've been fighting Whis a lot. And I've been recently fighting Beerus a lot too for the ultimate sacred water. But I don't know if I'll be able to upload any of it because Bandai. Now I I did the clip of the video, and then I tried to send it to YouTube, but I couldn't for some reason. And I I tried to record the recording of the video, but in the bottom left it showed like uh, the Bandai company thing like in the little back square, and I don't know what would happen if I would upload it like what. I don't know if I get copyrighted for some reason. I don't know why. But I'll try if this video gets 10 likes. And honestly, like, I know it seems that I'm playing like a noob. Because I was a noob at the time. But now I'm a goat. Nobody can stop me. I can't wait for uh, the Super Saiyan Blues to come out too.
And also, if you guys want to see me summon on the banner for some reason, I guess I could. But at the same time, I kind of want to save it for the Super Saiyan Blues. Because really, as long as at least one of them is a yellow unit, I'm going to spend all my crystals on it. But if none of them are a green unit, like if one of them is like a purple unit or something, or at least a red unit, then I guess I'll summon. Like if it's a red unit, I guess if it's a, one of them is a yellow unit, then oh yeah. If it's both, then definitely. Pink. Nope, never mind. That's a bit of a little hard something else, man. And like all the other LF cool sparking a lot like like um artworks are amazing but this transforming Vegito is something else man. Uh -huh, I'm immune. Too bad it isn't the Vegito Blue, otherwise I would have gotten rid of a card for the LF move. I don't want to see a trace of you left. I mean, unless this is all you've got. I miss that man. I haven't heard that in a long time. It still goes on? Okay. Well, I'm just gonna have to end it there because my recording is. Like stops in four minutes. Or you have to stop in four minutes. So the rest will be on the next day or whenever I feel like doing this event again. So on celebration I will do one of these ticket summons. Not get anything but coins. All right. Oh, hey. 
I'll see you guys. Well, again, let me know if you guys want to see me do summons on this banner. I kind of don't want to do it, but if you guys want to see me do it, then okay. I'll just spend the 3000 that I'll get. <laughs>